you think you should resign? This, would you have asked and called for them to step down? I think uh, there are people who've made mistakes in uh, in this life, and you make decisions based on what they actually uh, do, what they did, uh, and on a case-by-case -case basis. I think uh, I deeply regret that we that I did that. Uh, I should have known better, uh, but I didn't. Do you feel about this coming out right now? Uh, obviously, I, I regret uh, that I did it. Uh, it's not about timing. It's about having done something that I shouldn't have done, and I'm really sorry I did. Have you, you the only time you've done something like this, Mr. Trudeau? Is that the only time in your life you've ever done something like that? Uh, when I was in high school, I uh, dressed up at a uh, talent show uh, and sang Dale. Yeah, well, with, 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 uh, with makeup on. Au uh, secondaire, je me suis déguisé avec du maquillage et je chantais Dale. Vous avez demandé un nouveau adversaire de démissionner. Si quelqu'un au Parti conservateur avait fait ça, vous nous demanderiez aujourd'hui de démissionner. Je, je regarderais leur comportement et je regarderais euh, ce qu'ils ont fait. C'est sûr que euh, moi, je suis quelqu'un qui a euh, œuvré toute ma vie pour contrer l'intolérance et la discrimination. J'aurais dû savoir. Euh, même à cet âge-là, que j'aurais pas dû faire ça. Euh, mais euh, je l'ai fait et je m'en excuse profondément. Mr. Trudeau, this is something that I, I shouldn't have done many years ago, uh, and I recognize that I shouldn't have done it. Will you resign? Will you resign? Many in the United States, when they've been discovered that these sorts of things, they are asked to resign. Have you given thought to resign? Uh, I take responsibility for my uh, decision to do that. I shouldn't have done it. I should have known better. Uh, it was something that uh, I didn't think was racist at the time, but now I recognize um, it was something racist to do, and I am deeply sorry. And I wonder if you might place a call tonight to Jagmeet Singh, to Amarjeet Sohi, to Harjit Sajjan, if you have any words to, to say to some of your staff who may find this offensive. I have made uh, a number of calls uh, to uh, friends and colleagues tonight, and I will have many more colleagues, uh, ma many more calls to make. The conservatives say you're not as advertised. How can you look at Canadians and tell them that's not true? Uh, I have uh, worked all my life to try and uh, create opportunities for people to fight against racism and intolerance. Uh, and I can just uh, stand here and say that I made a, a mistake uh, when I was younger, and I wish I hadn't. Are you I should have known better then, uh, but I didn't, and I did it, and I am deeply sorry for it. If Are you one of your candidates had come out with one of these photos during the campaign, would an apology have been enough for you to allow them to stay? Uh, we would make that decision on a case-by-case -case basis and look at all the factors involved. Uh, but I can't answer a hypothetical one. Why should you be allowed to stay? Um, I'm going to be uh, asking Canadians to forgive me for what I did. I shouldn't have done that. I take responsibility for it. It was a dumb thing to do. I'm disappointed in myself. I'm pissed off at myself for having done it. I wish I hadn't done it, but I did it. And I apologize for it. You're going to know about this? for you to apologize for this. You've known that this happened a long time ago. I've been that. Uh, uh, I've been forthright uh, when this has come forward that it is something that uh, that I regret deeply having done. Your research team has been hammering the conservatives on social media. We've been told privately there's an arsenal of things still to come for inappropriate social media behavior in the past. Is all of that? How could you credibly do something like that now in the middle of a campaign after what we've all seen tonight? Uh, I've taken responsibility for it for having made a real mistake in the past. I, I stand here before Canadians as I will throughout this campaign and talk about the work we have to do to uh, make a better country together. And I'm going to continue to stay focused on that and continue to work to fight intolerance and discrimination, uh, even though, uh, obviously, I've made a mistake in the past. When did your team know about this? Mais comment vous pouviez ne pas savoir que c'était raciste quand vous aviez 30 ans? Il y a 20 ans, j'ai pris une décision que j'aurais pas dû prendre, et je le regrette profondément. Comment vous allez prendre cette décision? Uh, j'ai pris cette décision et j'en prends la responsabilité. What does this mean for your campaign? Uh, 
This means uh, uh, that I'm going to continue to work very hard to demonstrate to Canadians that uh, I'm always going to try and uh, take responsibility for my mistakes, but always work towards uh, a better future for all Canadians. That's, I have uh, uh, a big day in Winnipeg tomorrow where I'm going to be meeting with Canadians. We're going to continue getting out there across the country and talking about uh, the kind of future we all need to roll up our sleeves and build. Do you feel about other candidates who may have made mistakes on social media or other things in the past? Maybe you should have given a little bit more latitude. I think this is something, that, like everything, that you have to evaluate on a case-by-case -case basis. This is something that I, I take seriously and I take responsibility for. I'm pissed off at myself, obviously. I'm disappointed in myself and uh, I'm apologizing to Canadians. What does taking responsibility mean? What is the consequence? For a, a lot of your candidates, this would be at least calls for resignation. This would be calls okay. for important conversations with all those candidates and uh, real stake in taking stock in the path forward. And I'm having conversations with, with uh, my colleagues, with fellow candidates, and I'm going to be continuing to having conversations uh, with Canadians about this and about many other things that we're uh, hoping to work together on positively. You said you've had conversations with individuals probably over the last hour. In talking to racialized members of your cabinet and your caucus, what have they said to you? Are they disappointed? Um, I, well, I, I've said to them uh, what I'm saying here. How? Uh, what did I, they think I, to you? I've said to them what I, I'm saying here, how I take responsibility for it, how I did something that I really shouldn't have done, and I'm disappointed and pissed off in myself. Uh, what they said, uh, but frankly, I'm, I am touched by having as thoughtful a team around me as I have. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.